Assalamualaikum and hello everyone. My name is Afiq Shamil bin Zainal Abidin and today I would like to present about machining maintenance BMMI 3234. For the company background, Glassfield is one of the leading manufacturers in Malaysia. It offers customers a one-stop solution for mold fabrication and plastic injection. Glassfield one-stop solution includes in-house design, tooling expertise, providing professional parts and drawing according to the most exact specification. In-house trial and submit sample for customer approval to maintain our top quality assurance. Glassfield has achieved ISO 9001-2015 Quality Management Certification. During the process of achieving ISO 9001, Glassfield has continuously improved the business area and product and service as well to provide efficient and excellent products and service. When we want to identify machine and process, Glassfield Polymer is an industry to focus on the fabrication of polymer-based product. The product mainly manufactured by injection molding process. During the production activities, a lot of machineries and material involved. Figure 1 and Figure 2 show some machineries that are commonly used in the warehouse. As you can see for the Figure 1, it shows that the crushing machine and the Figure 2 is the forklift. For the plastic crusher, it specializes in crushing various kinds of plastic material into granules or different size. Crushed plastic can be recycled for reproduction of plastic product. This machine can help to minimize the volume of plastic waste, great safe cost and resources. Plastic crusher machine can crush variety of materials such as PVC, TPR, PP, PE, EVA, PET, PC, TP material and other materials such as waste rubber product, sponge, and etc. As you can see, the first picture shows that the crusher machine and the second picture shows the crushed material which is plastic. For the safety precaution of crusher machine, all personnel must wear safety equipment such as safety boots, goggles, and gloves. Next, Avoiding feeding a big size of material to the machine because it will increase the tendency of the machine being stuck. Feeding should be uniform to prevent machine overload. Next, always monitor the temperature of motor bearing. The temperature must not exceed 60 degrees Celsius. And last but not least, ensure all the material are completely crushed before stopping the machine. Next, moving on to the next machine, which is forklift. A forklift is a type of vehicle categorized as a powered industrial truck. They are used to lift and move various material over short distance. A typical forklift is defined by a small truck frame with a front-facing mass assembly that is responsible for rising and lowering the carried load. Uh, forklifts are designed to a multitude of specification in order to handle load with different maximum weight and different centers of gra and gravity. Forklift can be subjected to a variety of safety regulation depending on the type of forklift being used as well as the task being performed and the environment in which it is being used. In addition to operational safety standards, forklift are also subjected to training standard. In most jurisdictions, employees are responsible for ensuring that all powered industrial truck operators successfully complete a recognized training program. Moving on to the identifying troubleshoot for the machine. For the crusher machine, the crusher machine often stuck due to material that are not fully crushed. And the purpose maintenance is the rotating blade need to be sharpened or changed. For fault lift, uh, worn out tire condition and suspension due to daily use and carries heavy load which puts stress on the tires. So for the purpose maintenance, replace, uh, replace any worn out tires to ensure track traction and forklift handling stability. For the recommendation for maintenance schedule, both machine, crusher machine and forklift are recommended to do daily maintenance and breakdown maintenance. First, the preventive maintenance, crusher, crusher machine, check hydraulic fluid and ensure machine clear from any strap material that can affect the machine efficiency. For the forklift, ensure the battery is fully charged and check for any damage that can cause safety issues. For the breakdown maintenance, crusher machine change the rotating blade due to blade chip off or blunt. For the forklift, change tire and service the suspension to increase the efficiency and safety while operating the forklift. 
Moving on to the improvement for each machine, for the crusher machine, do not overloading the material that need to be crushed at a time and always ensure the hydraulic oil is sufficient. For the forklift, ensure the battery water is in a safety level, use a suitable tire type to prevent from slipping. Recommendation of machine production improvement Have an organized floor management system Next, skilled employee, which is employee that are more knowledgeable, make fewer mistakes and deliver a high standards And then, follow the scheduled maintenance to avoid machine failure For the purpose improvement of safety for each machine, for the crusher machine, often check for any start material after performing the crushing process Routinely clear the working environment for the forklift, always operating the forklift with care and do not load beyond its safe capacity. Make sure to always change the forklift and park it at a safe place. Next, propose troubleshoot improvement. The first one is communicate the decision of the troubleshooting with an expert. And next, develop and try to find a better solution that can reduce the tendency of machine failure. And that's all for me. Thank you for watching and see you again. Bye-bye.